have to admit, I really like that bass. So, anyways, we got a Fender American Pro Jazz Bass 5 in Ash versus a Sire V7 Vintage 5 string. Both have graphite reinforcements, which on the Sire side only happens on the 5 string. Five strings, and both are great basses. Gorgeous. One's natural, one is Olympic white. Uh, take your pick. We're only doing uh, the passive uh, sound and both pickups up um, and the tone up. Uh, gorgeous bass, a solid built. I'm going to talk a little bit in between the playing um, to give you my ideas. But anyways, let's get started. actually pretty happy with those tones let's play a little bit more forward and maybe um, emphasize that B string a bit more so we can hear how low it goes <laughs> So, by the way, I'm playing this all in passive mode, both pickups. with the fender. Mm, love it. And also here, both pickups are fully turned up. Tone knob is up as well. Yeah. Thank you. 
right, guys. So I'm wrapping this up. Merci beaucoup for letting me play this. Um, kept it simple. Tried to hit the uh, lower C. This track is in C. Uh, which one is better? Let me know. Which one did you feel more? My thought is, on terms of distribution on these bases, the Saya is heavier. Not my much. It's surprising because the American Pro is already a pretty thick bass. Uh, the American Pro has a thicker, wider neck by a little bit, um, but uh, the Saya also has a pretty solid neck. It's not thin. It's not like a Getty Lee neck or something. It's a solid, uh, nicely crafted neck. In terms of response, I think uh, that the American Pro, uh, the dynamics are a little bit more contained. Uh, it's less in your face. Um, slaps and things like that stay just more inside. Um, it's uh, less dominant when you're on stage. So if you're in a trio or quartet or something like that, uh, the sire might, even in passive mode, and I, I tested it all in passive mode here, uh, it has a little bit more, um, yeah, it's a bit louder in the, in a sense. You know what I mean by louder? Um, but for, for larger stuff, I think that the American Pro will stay more in the pocket, more on the inside and not get in the way. It is close. Uh, but there's a difference. Some of it is because it's Ash uh, versus Alder. So um, that's the thing. I might even keep both. Um, both have an excellent B string. I mean, it's I absolutely fantastic. You can use it. So here's the dilemma. Um, but I'll leave you to that. And uh, you can decide. Both are great bases. I'm not going to talk about the price and all that. That's a completely different equation. But both are great. And... Um, I don't think you can go wrong with either. I'm going to leave you with a couple more clips from a previous video. Enjoy. Yeah. 